Sir, four targets approaching. Look friendly. Roger that. Stand down. <laughs> Captain Morgan, I presume? Yes, sir. Come in. We need all the men we can get. Glad you can make it, but what happened to the vehicles you were assigned and the rest of your men? We were ambushed, sir. We lost all of them. Sorry to hear that, but at least you're alive. The more men, the better. So what are we doing here, sir? This is the major rendezvous point for 50 miles. Unfortunately, only a dozen of us are here now. You mean, we're the only ones left? No, we have had radio contact with a lot of scattered men within our area, but they're hiding. If they try to get to us, they'll be seen. Wait, aren't the Russians taking prisoners, sir? Only officers. The others stay. We understand, sir. Is there anything we can do? Yes. Captain, please come with me. You other three, just relax around here. We have about three weeks worth of supplies. We chose this garage because it has perfect cover and even a generator outside. What we're supposed to do is stop the Russian advance through this city. A dozen men, sir. With all due respect, this is hardly the resistance I expected. Yes, I know. I was expecting at least 200. So what can we do against an entire army? Slow them down. We have soldiers from overseas returning to North America in fives. We can expect the majority to start helping within a week. And when will the Russians be here? In a few days. Sir, reporting back from recon. Find anything? No, sir. It's all clear. Good. I want you two to relax and just watch the radar. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Major, I wanted to know. For the past few days, we've gotten no reason why we're being invaded. Any idea why? No, I don't have an idea. But I know why. Did HQ inform you? No. I found it off the body of a Russian officer. His orders? They are supposed to take over every major city of the U.S. and its major resources. That's it? Negative. They're going to export everything. Automobiles, oil, clothing, agricultural, machinery, you name it. If they mean to take away all that, it will send us back 200 years in technology. That's only the half of it. We captured one soldier who claimed the materials were going to be used to help Russia's citizens. It's a disaster over there for the population. Most of their teenagers smoke. The cities are polluted. I can understand why they need the stuff. But why not ask for help? Why use force? I don't know. The soldier died of his wounds before he could tell us. Well, Major, whatever it is me and my squad have to do to push these bastards out, we'll do it. We've seen the eyes of hell. Courtyard looks clear. Let's head back. Right behind. Whoa, what a fine collection of vehicles we've got here. Yeah, it's good for just a few of us. Hey, didn't that guy have a partner earlier? Yeah, he did. Hey, Matthews, where'd Thomas go? Well, he should be right here. God damn it, where did he go? I'll be right back.
No, I'll go with you. Okay, let's go. Dead. You didn't see this? No, it must have been silent. Let's get out of here before we get sniped. It must have been a scout sniper. <gasps> oh, crap. And then the pig said to the horse, What is a long pig? You're retarded. Where's the captain? He's upstairs. Why? What's wrong? Captain, sir. Thomas and Matthew, sir. They're dead. They got sniped. What? Radar is clear of all movement. Must have been a scout sniper, sir. Sir, I suggest we go to an alert phase. Alert the men downstairs. Sir, I see 200 individual targets inbound. They're not moving very fast. Probably not expecting resistance, sir. Then we have the advantage. Lock and load, people. Get ready for a fight.